Jacob, do you know what day it is? No, Oliver. What is today? Today's our last day of high school! Yeah! yeah! So are you coming to my end of high school party tonight? You had me a party. Good, so it's going to be me, you, and Kyle. Nice. The three amigos. Mountains of snacks and soda running like water. It's going to be awesome. So you're sure your parents won't be there tonight? No, they won't be, but my uncle will be. Your uncle? Yeah, my uncle Ron from Israel. He came to complete his pod certificate um, here in the States. So he crashes with my parents while he's here. Well, that doesn't sound too bad. But that's not the worst part. He's, he's going to keep an eye on us. What? Why? When I just told my parents about the party, they didn't care that we'll be all alone. But then my uncle said he's coming, and they thought it would be perfect for him to watch over us. As if we'll get into trouble. But we never get in trouble. It's like they don't trust you at all. What can I do? If I tell them that my uncle doesn't have to be there, they're going to be even more suspicious and make him check up on us every five minutes. Are you okay, guys? You need anything, guys? Did you turn off all the lights, guys? Oh, he's so annoying sometimes. Don't worry about it. I mean, as long as your parents don't bother us. I don't care. They won't. They left for a two months vacation earlier today for the 20th anniversary. They're out of the picture. Good. Let's go buy stuff. Take the long road. I want to enjoy this. Roads? Where we going, we don't need roads. to buy more books in Hebrew. He always buy, he always reads so much like of the same book and then like he reads it 15 times and then he reads it more because I mean I don't know I don't get how you can read the same book so many times even though he knows the ending. It's just it's just weird to me. Oliver Here we go. A team will deem La Redette Lesa Kink Le Mata Ani Rak Mevakesh Shitesh Maru Al Hakul Naki Besadu Sit down Good, so you had fun with the game. If you need something, say something to me, okay? Alright, Mahuama? What's up? Lama 
אתה לא יכול פשוט לאמור לי? גם אתה לא יכול פשוט ללמוד אנגלית. I'll see you later, Mom. Try not to get too drunk this time. Hi, I'm Kyle. Is Oliver here? Oliver, yes, what girl? One, two, three, four, five. Come on. Call him Kyle, not Kyle. What are you doing?
רון. 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 עכשיו בסדר? אתה עומד לספר לי מה קרה? וואט? הוא עושה את הדור אסטי. אוקיי. ספר לי מה קרה? Are you going to tell me if something happened? Nothing happened. טוב, אז יאללה. מה קרה לך שאתה לא מדבר עברית יותר? עזוב, אני לא רוצה לדעת. Let's go guys! Okay. Who are you? Watch out! Have a good night. Thank you. Hey, what took so long? I must have been tired. I had this weird hallucination. Really? You all right now? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine. All right, let's get it. at last. You thought it would be thrilling to challenge death itself. I will show you what happens when you challenge us. I am looking forward to seeing you die. Death, usually appears as a cloaked figure riding a pale horse, is one of the four horsemen of the apocalypse described in the New Testament. A more common version of death is seen wearing a black robe to indicate a priest's robe during medieval times, looking like a skeleton and carrying a scythe to split the soul from the body. 
This is the face of death. Do you guys think that the Sankita Warfare is a sequel to rock em all? What? Do you guys see this? What? The park? This? A few trees and a little bit of grass? It's pathetic. Do you guys see that guy over there? Where? The new the guy. guy. Right over there? I don't see anybody else. Uh, Maybe it, I just didn't sleep well last night. Never mind. You tripped. Let, 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 let's, just, let's just go to the other side. Kyle, watch out! What is it? You guys seriously didn't see this? See what? The black guy that was standing right there! Hey man, that's racist. No, I didn't mean the black guy, I meant a guy that's wearing black. Was it a cop? No, it wasn't a... What does it matter if it's a cop? So, Kyle, did you do something? No, my, my mom got kicked out of another bar. She threw up on a bartender. That's the third one this month. No, it wasn't a cop. I have to show you guys something. I don't get it. The Green Ripper. I think he's real, and I think he's following me. I saw him two days ago at the door, and today in the park, and the field. He was right next to you, Jacob. Seriously? Are you sure you weren't, like, imagining it, dude? I don't know, maybe. So let's just say this is some guy that's, like, chasing you. Did you call 911? I did, but then he disappeared. <sighs> I can't make some cops come here and wait until he shows up again. Alright, let's be serious now. It's probably someone playing a prank on you. So the next time you see someone, let us know and we'll take care of it. That's the thing, you didn't see him today. Look, I wouldn't worry about it. So, I mean, maybe if you just ignore him, he'll go away. And then, even if he doesn't and he tries to like do stuff still, then we'll catch him. Are you sure? Oh yeah. Plus, dude, we still have two months to go, okay? So, you don't want to be like hiding or anything because some freaking creep, dude. No, I guess you're right. Yeah, that's my boy. Alright, so me and Kyle are gonna get some more snacks. You want anything at all? No, I'm good. Alright. Well, see you later, man.
911, what's your emergency? Hello, yes. Never mind. Hey, Oliver. I'm gonna go take my test scope out and do some astronomy. I'll be back later. Sure, have fun. Oh, by the way, my back's hurting again. Do you mind if I take the bed when I get back? Oh yeah, don't worry. I'm going to kick Jacob's butt in this game. Let's go! Okay, three things. One, get out of the way. Two, who are you? And three, get out of the way. Here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna look into my telescope again, and I'm gonna see Mars. Or you're gonna learn telescope maintenance after you use it to beat someone with. This is better, my dog. Hey Kyle, you're up. Remember, we're going to the pool. Hey, do you know if Kyle is up? Hey, Kyle, wake up. We need to go. All right, I'm coming in. Good morning, New York. Come on, time to get up. Jacob, come help me wake the sleepy head. Yeah, I'm coming. What's up? Dude, come on, wake up. We got plenty to do today. We got a whole lot planned. Who the hell even sleeps like that anyways? What the hell? Why does this dude sleep like this, bro? It's so weird. Oh, the bro, he's all clammy. What the heck? Shoot. Get me a mirror. Shoot. Here you go. Thank you. What are you going to do with that? You'll see. Shoot, there's no moisture. So? Moisture indicates that they're breathing. If you hold it close, it'll fog up. And it didn't fog up when he did it. That's what that means.
Thanks, Wallen. Talk to you later. Do you know how he died? Are you boys related to the deceased? Um, no. Sorry, boys. Can't help you. Please, sir. We were really good friends. All right. I'm going to get the papers. Thank you. Well, according to this report, your friend did not hang himself or anything like that. We'd have to perform an autopsy to get a better understanding of his untimely death. mind if we go into another room so we can have some privacy? I need to ask you a few questions. Okay. Please have a seat. First of all, can I get your names? Oliver Goodman. Jacob Schneider. So boys, which one of you saw Kyle last? Actually, we both did. Yeah, I slept on the couch. Did he tell you anything before he went into the room? He asked me if he can have the room for the night because he wanted the bed. He said his back hurts. Do you know why he closed the door? Maybe he wanted some privacy. Maybe he wanted to talk to his girlfriend and didn't want to be embarrassed. I see. Now tell me about this morning. Trace back your steps regarding your friend. Well, we planned to go to the pool because it was supposed to be very warm today. I didn't want to catch him by surprise, so I knocked on the door. He didn't answer, so I tried again. When he did, still didn't answer, I opened the door and tried to wake him up. I didn't know he was dead. I got Jacob to help me. Then we noticed that his body was cold. Jacob asked me for a mirror and put it in front of Kyle's face for a minute. Then he said that Kyle is not breathing, so we called 911. That's it. Jacob, that was very smart of you. Where did you learn that trick with the mirror? Yeah, I mean, I saw it in the movie once, so I figured why not try it. I know this must be difficult for you fellows, but I want to give it to you straight. From what the police say, either your friend put an end to his life, or one of you guys killed him. Please let me finish, and then there will be time for questions, I promise. Just between us, you fellows don't strike me as the kind of people who would go around and do such a thing. But depending on the autopsy, we might need to question you in a more proper manner. Is that clear? All right, if you guys do have any questions or just want to tell me something, don't hesitate to call the St. Louis Police Department and ask for me. Tell them your names and I'll know it's you fellows. You think that she thinks we did it? I don't know. These cops can be reverse, reverse, reverse ecology on you if they want it. I just hope she won't arrest us just because. And she's just toying with us? I mean, not unless she has an arrest warrant. But for that, she needs to have a reason to believe we did it. But what if she thinks she found a reason? My parents won't care that I tell them I'm innocent. If a police officer says so, it's good enough for them. So we really just need to find the real reason that Kyle died before the police do. Do you have any ideas? Yes, one. Well, what is it? I think the Green Reaper did it. Oh, 
Are you still stuck on that? What do you mean? I thought you believed me. No, dude. I never believed you. And neither did Kyle. And we just wanted to be good friends and supported our friend with his crazy ideas. But he's real. I saw him. Well, whatever you saw, dude, there must be an explanation other than the Grim Reaper. That kind of stuff isn't real. What about ghosts? What about them? Ghosts can be real. They might be real, but we're talking about the Grim Reaper. Listen, dude. If you get proof that this thing exists, I'll believe you. Until then, find a more possible theory, please. Fine. Thank you. Now, do you think Kyle would have killed himself? No, he didn't strike me as that kind of guy. I mean, you knew him longer than I did. Do you think that his girlfriend broke up with him and that's why he did it? I just said I don't think he did it. Well, I don't know, you have to look at the facts. There was no one else in there with him at all, and all the entrances and exits were closed. I mean, none of them went in there in the middle of the night. None of us did, right? Well, I don't know. I don't see why he couldn't have killed himself. I mean... I think we should go tomorrow and see that paramedic. And he'll tell us what the cause of death was. Good idea. I mean, in the meanwhile, how about we ask your uncle? Maybe he saw something. Won't hurt to try. Fine, have you seen something last night? What we had here was a failure to communicate. Uh, tell them I'm busy. They're saying they came to ask about their friend Kyle. Send them in. Please sit down. So, what can I do for you boys? Um, we want to know how Kyle died. You know what I told you back then? That was out of the goodness of my heart. I wasn't supposed to tell you boys anything, and yet I did. But you boys have to be related to the deceased at this time for me to share any new information we have with you. I'm sorry. But what if we were really good friends? No. What if we get permission from his mom? No. But what if we forge documents that say we're related? Hell no. So there's nothing we can do? Diane, please escort them out. Yes, sir. No problem. So, here we are again. I presume you miss your friend. You did it? As if you didn't figure it out by now. You have no understanding of how doomed you are. You are insignificant. If I'm so insignificant, why do you keep showing up and talking to me? Quite clever, but not clever enough. You must mistake me for a puny human being who gains enjoyment from unveiling their future plans. You say human like you're not, but you have to be. 
Oh, how narrow is the mind of man, which cannot comprehend the mere possibility that forces beyond his control are at play. Leave me alone! <sighs> Do not think it is you who banishes me from the confines of this vehicle. You will never be safe while I'm around. St. Louis Police Department, how may we help you? Hello, uh, this is Oliver. I'm, I'm looking for Officer Miller. Just a moment, please, sir. Alright, thank you. This is Officer Miller. Hello, Officer. Um, this is Oliver Goodman. Uh, you investigated the death of my friend Kyle. Oh, right. Oliver, how can I help you? Um, there's someone following me for about a week now. Then why are you only telling us this now? Because I thought it was just some guy who's trying to prank me or something, but I'm starting to think this guy killed Kyle. That's a very severe claim you just made. Do you have any proof? Well, um, not so much. Well, listen, I can't arrest anybody just because you think he murdered your friend. But if I have time, I'll try to come by your house and see if I can shed some light on whatever's going on there. That will be great. Thanks. No problem. Yeah, Mom. I'm good. All right, I'll talk to you later. Hey, Oliver, where's the snacks at, bro? I can't go buy them right now. Why? You wouldn't believe me if I told you. Did you see that stupid Grim Reaper again, dude? I didn't imagine him. He was right there in my car. I thought you saw him earlier, dude. He mostly comes out at night. Mostly. <laughs> and what did he do in your car? He said he murdered Kyle. And what do you do? The hokey pokey and give you a balloon animal? But what if he comes to kill me next? Frankly, my dude, I don't give a shit. <sighs> but you have to believe me! Dude, there's always a logical explanation for this kind of thing. The fact that you think the embodiment of death killed him is absurd. Can you not be crazy for one summer, dude? You don't understand. In two months, I won't be going to college. In two months, I'll be dead. And then my ghost will hunt you and make your life a living nightmare! Why do you always have to be so pessimistic, dude? I'm not pessimistic. I'm optimistic with experience. You know what? I think you should go home. Okay. We'll do that. Suit yourself. Hello? What's up, Mom? Yeah, I'm on my way. Alright, I'll get you some groceries then. Bro, seriously, dude, I'm not trying to do this right now. Bro, that is the stupidest costume I've ever freaking seen, dude. Let me come in and take this hood off, then, boy. <coughs> oh my god! You better believe your friends next time. Alright, alright, I'm coming. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Dude, what's going on? Dude, you were right. What are you talking about? I saw the Grim Reaper! You saw him? Yeah! I'm sorry, man, I, I really can't believe you guys. I didn't believe that. Oh, you mean you think it's me in a costume, maybe? No! He was bony! He had, like, just bones! He was so skinny! Did he do anything to you? No. So why are you so scared? Because he's coming here right now! Guys, they walked off. 
Actually, my closet bit weighs some images. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. How does this thing, this guy, know so much about us? What do you mean? Well, I mean, he followed us to the park and he knew I left the other day. What's your point? I think it's someone that we know or someone in this house. But who could it be? Who was the first person to see him? Oh, I think my uncle did. Wait, you can't take him. It doesn't feel so good. He hasn't been feeling good for days. Wait a minute. Ron is really sick. And he only got sick the day before I saw the rape for the first time. Wait a minute. Was there someone at the door? Like a few days ago? Yeah. Hey you, stop! Well, I guess those boys were right. Come with me to the station. Son of a... Don't worry, I got this. Fortunately for you, you're not the one I'm after. No one escapes death. Who are you to decide? That came from up there. Till next time. Oliver, you need to be careful. It's not your time, but the four will come to kill you. So be very careful and trust no one. Who are you? Your friend Kyle has one last thing to say to you. Ah, oh, good. Where am I now? First I was in the bedroom, then I was in a place I can't even describe, and now I'm here. Can you decide already? Don't reveal all the secrets of heaven, Kyle. Oh yeah? What are you gonna do to me? I'm already dead. Be, Be careful, careful, or we'll send you back down there. Fine. You done touching my intestines? I can't even deal with this guy anymore. Send me back. What are you? I cannot tell you what, but your destiny awaits you. What the hell just happened?